So two of the like stronger Victorian players against the two internationals that have yeah. come down for this the tournament. German players are putting on a strong showing. Yes. Yep. We can't say it's that unexpected, but we're getting straight into this game. But here we go. We're right on 2 o'clock yep. as well, so well done there. True 4, starting off strong with massive stage control with not a percent lead, but... Yeah. Yeah, uh, Jay Dizzle, I think, has played a couple games against True 4 in Victoria themselves. Yeah. And, uh... Yeah, I think there's been a bit of an issue with... Shulk in general come uh, in Victoria having no experience prior to True Four comes from yeah, up. Yeah, fair enough. Strix, our prim premier Shulk player in Australia, is from ACT. He hasn't travelled, hasn't travelled out of New South Wales or ACT that much. Yep. So, oh, going for the up throw <laughs> off air 50-50. The cheeky jump, Monados. Yep. I don't know if it would have killed at 71 on Battlefield. Uh, to little, turn that gives a little boy. Oh, oh that's gonna kill though. The smash. Smash Monado, up smash, <laughs> catching Toon Link with all the active frames. And this is what's... See, is Shulk is a... True 4 is a player who will push his advantage really hard. Um, but not so much aggressively, but instead patiently. Uh, Extra himself has called him lame. <laughs> very lame. But, uh, ironically, not ironically, but I guess also... Uh, Jay Dizzle has been called lame by Extra as well. <laughs> <So> <laughs> <laughs> too lame. Extra hates both of these yeah. players and their characters. True Four was, was True Four was sitting on only 34% when he took Jono's first stop, but it looks like he's been trying to play it patiently. But kind of, it's he's been trying to play it patiently, but Toon Link just content to throw his projectiles at him, and it's just been working out. Yeah. yeah. Ooh. No, I like True Four. True right Four is going playing like. All right, he's going to hit him a bit more again. The passive play clearly wasn't working out for him. Yeah, and he's at that point now which he can just throw himself at, at Jay Dizzle. And there's not not really that much of a cost. I mean, the momentum swing could be really bad. Yeah. But, at the end of the day, he has another stock in his pocket. Sitting in shield, Monado, just kind of slowly make yeah, his way over. just rolling that boat bit by bit. I mean, it's, it's, hard to, it's, hard, it's pretty hard to roll a boat quickly when you're only one man rowing on one yeah. side. <laughs> Ooh. That was a really well placed board. A hit sent yeah. shelf all the way across the screen. And then we have the even stocks. Uh, John did a good job there of not really taking much percentage as a deficit, only capping at 47%. Yeah. Um, true, but this big sword's going to be a real four, issue on the edge. True 4 once again in a great position to control the stage and try and keep Tim Link off stage. But J Dizzle smartly using a bomb to get back onto the stage. And here we are, as I said, the patience come out of both of these players. Uh, True Four going for the jump, to go around the platforms, and Jono's happy to stand there with his projectiles and just keep throwing them. True Four still holding the lead, still willing to play patient, standing around in speed, Monado. It's not something you'd think would happen at all. Right? He's just looking for his opening. Yeah, because when he does, he's going to run in there as quick as he can and just slice Jono up. But he's almost getting the sense evened up now. One or two more hits and we'll be back at even even games. Jay Dizzle now. Oh, pretty good control, but hurt. whiffing the forward smash and getting punished hard. That's game one the true for. Where do you think we'll be going? Uh, I feel like maybe... I'm going to try and read his lips here. <laughs> Instead of having a guess. I think maybe FD would be banned. FD is probably a solid ban in this matchup. I I think... F with an FD ban, Toon Link would probably be looking for some... I reckon in this match he'd probably be looking for Town and City, possibly? Yeah, I would have said Town and City as well. Uh, I'm not I'm not the most well-versed in each of these yeah. characters, but... Based on... Oh, okay, we're going straight back. back. Personally, I never Three. thought of this to be a great Toon Link stage, but... It's, I do think it's a pretty solid shock stage, so... Yeah, there's a little, there's areas in which he can kind of hide under the platform and use his yeah. projectiles to kind of build a little, little nest, I guess. Oh. But uh, the platforms are also, yeah, as, as you said, pretty good for Shulk. Yeah. Um, Shulk's up tilt and aerial's pretty good at covering entire platforms. And platforms are pretty good at, like, trying to just save yourself from having to land into projectiles and yeah. stuff. So. Oh. That back air, flashing against the arrow and kind of extending its, its distance there. Yeah. 
Truthful once again in full control of the stage, but Ten just messing up and getting hit for a bomb yeah. by a bomb. And one thing that Jadis was really good at is his bomb use. His conversions off bombs and boomerangs are incredible. That was a really there we good go. It's just like that. that. I mean, he's once again and he's still going. The lead. He's covering he's really most of his options strong with bombs. bomb pressure here at the ledge. Nice use of the upper. Reverse upper. This is a very different game than yeah. the first one. Jadis are looking like he's found his flow. Just kind of. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he may have. Uh, he may have put his. He may have put his. Uh, his slower, slower playstyle in the back of the thing. It didn't work for the first time. Yeah. Um, so a bit more of aggression coming out of Jadis and showing the tricks he has to do, and it's paying off. Depending on the matchup, it can be hard to play patiently versus patient play. Yeah. Like. We can see how the aggression really has been working out for both of the plays in this matchup, actually. Because when when Truthful was standing back last game, trying to take it patiently, he was just getting pelted with everything. Oh. Forward air going to seal out that stock. 74% on Schultz. Yes! <laughs> his shield was broken if, yeah. he, if he didn't let go of that. Oh, what did a shield poke there? Either way. I don't know. I reckon he probably dropped it. Ooh. So this is a really solid lead for J-Dizzle. Taking the tip of that back air to the face once again. Uh, true 4 not planning on dying anymore. No, he's maybe. going straight to shield. And he's going to use every ounce of that. Ooh. Oh. Very nicely done there, but fortunately no hitbox. <laughs> Just not quite fast enough to punish yeah. that. <laughs> but now we're in speed, Monado. Man, no speed. I suppose on Battlefield, it's harder to utilize jump to try and get over the yeah. projectiles because of the way the platforms are aimed. So, but like speed forces lowers Shulk's jump height and can make it a bit more difficult to get over the projectiles and punish. So, oh, oh, calls him out. Very away. nice off smash. And that's game two to Jay-Z. Tying up the set 1-1. One, one. Yeah, and we have Extra sitting behind them there. He's directly behind True 4 in the camera, I think. Oh, no, he's actually a bit off. He's next to Pudge. Ooh. He's watching both these characters. Probably a bit happy that one of them are getting sent to Lucis. Yeah. <laughs> without him having to do it. Yeah. He's like, I just hope both of them lose. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and we're going to town and city now. This is True 4's pick. I guess I might have been getting my things backwards. Dang. You should say words. <laughs> yeah. Alright. We got a solid display in neutral going on here. Yeah. So now with Town and City, on Town and City with way more height between the main stage and the platforms, Shulk is more free to utilize Jump Monado, just kind of weave his way all around Toon Link's projectile game. Speed just not really, not really the most effective tool of getting in. Yeah. Ooh, I gotta agree with you there. And especially with these projectiles constantly being thrown at you, you don't really get the the real benefit of running towards someone at that yeah. sort of speed. Because exactly. you just get stopped in your tracks. Yeah. yeah. Switching to Buster when Toon Link is would be very much a kill percent. We haven't really seen much Buster come out of True 4 in this set. True. It's been a lot, of a lot of speed and a lot of shield and a lot of jump. I suppose in a matchup like this, Buster's not that great because you're expecting to take a bit of damage approaching. Yeah, and the Toon Link up tilt combos that you can get, yeah. the follow-ups does a lot of damage. Yeah. This is... J-Dizzle committing pretty hard to that ledge coverage. This true 4 just saying, no, nah, I don't want any of that. Yeah. True 4 switching the shield. Just, he was, he's nowhere near death at this point. No. See what he can do with his jump, kind of just... Whether he's going to do that, yeah, well, he's just spend just, the he, time... He doesn't really like to jump yeah. <laughs> He's spending the time just away from Jay Dizzle, waiting for that moment, just to kind of get to weave in and out between Ooh, his projectiles and calls it really straight out there. Really smart by True 4. Very well done with that. 
that up B. Once again in shield, Monado. Just taking his sweet time. Maybe get 4% in from in there. 8% yeah. from the jabs. j has worked out, but he can kind of just find the find the end lag of the, of the startup lag even. Of that kind of boat paddle and just get under him, and then he's away from the corner. Yeah. j Seems oh. to be fishing pretty hard for these kill moves. Kind of, he just he just wants shock dead. Not yeah. that I can blame him. Yeah, check your little bomb re grab there. Something he's really good at too. Bomb going off in True Force hands, stopping him from really applying, applying the pressure. But Jay Dizzle not really in a position to capitalize that, capitalize on that, and make it back into the stage. Ooh. Go oh, on the same thing as last yeah. time. And speed Monado preventing Shulk from recovering there. Jade did a little bit extra there. It was more aware of what was happening, so maybe did it actively earlier, a bit later, trying to combat that that slash. But these bomb games. Very nice use of the back air to just fight the oh. fight through the projectile. One thing you can notice here is Jay Dizzle's got very good shield pressure. Yeah. Um, it keeps him to usually keeps him in shield to about halfway through. Um, most of the times he's applying that pressure. Right. That's really important against the Shulk because if you keep him in shield, then he has no sort of like reason to use his weird Monados kind of to get out of it. Shulk not with wow. not really the greatest startup, but doesn't really matter when you're in such a advantageous position like that. Yeah. He pushes his advantage really hard. Yeah. Shock's got his big sweeping aerials to just kind of cover all your aerial options. It's interesting you do mention the, the startups of Shulk, yeah. uh, which is a good point. You can notice that there's, there's quite the telegraphed approach yeah. um, that Shulk has to kind of get in. So, Dreamland for game four. Oh! I feel like, like the stages that have been played on, I feel like I'd expect the other player to be picking. Personally. Yeah. But I, I guess I'm not the player. Yeah. <laughs> the reason why we're on this side of the setup. Yeah. Another thing, another note about, I mean, shock startup can be pretty bad, but so can Toon Link, so I'm not sure how much of a factor that's going to be. Yeah, that's right, and because J.D. is going for these F-smashes and up-smashes, um, he's leaving himself in that sort of lag. Yeah, going uh, with a really aggressive Nair approach on shield now, not working out. Like, he's just he's just coming in swinging. Yeah. Well, good call out there from J.D. Dizzle. Shulk, once again, the center stage with Toon Link, looking almost content to play from the corner. Yeah, he's happy to be in the corner. Your opponent's only going to come from one direction, really, and that's yeah. from the center. Yeah. That's fair. Interesting, just dash skid to short hop there. Yeah, yeah. Looks like True 4, he probably was looking for something else, he just didn't quite get it, but managed to get a punish anyway. Oh, not getting that bounce off there with the boomerang like he would have intended. True 4 just sitting around, waiting for his opening. There, his shield's coming up to running out now. Which is where Jay Dizzle needs to capitalize if he wants to take this stock out. Ooh. Not jumping off quite yet. Yeah, go to deep for that one. I was expecting a slightly more aggressive landing option now, honestly. Yeah. An almost suicidal one, bro. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I was waiting for a down air too, just to come straight down on top of his head. <laughs> would have been, would have been <laughs> very interesting. To really see. ballsy. Ooh. Going for, he keeps going for these air slash edge guards, and honestly, I mean, he got it once already. Does he need it again? Yeah. Jody just worked that out, so he's kind of using his air dodges a little bit more accurately. I don't think he's really worked out these back airs though. No. Back air with the range and the hitboxes to be able to fight through arrows and boom. There we go. Good use there to kind of use the clock. Yeah. Just kind of... Just kind of time out your opponent's patience. Show them you're willing to wait longer than they are. Just wait for them to just almost lose their attention. Yeah. 
Oh, oh. That was not quite the all or nothing sort of approach that could have been disastrous for True 4 if he didn't hit that. These back airs are really putting in work. Like, they're not even getting punished when they do get blocked. Yeah. That was interesting. <laughs> yeah, decided to swap places with JD's all. It's like, I don't need this stage. Dash attack to follow up. <laughs> That's a new one. That's not That's unlo Oh, he's missed! <laughs> Unfortunately <laughs> for J-Dizzle, Schultz not that great of a character. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, nice use of the boomerang to with tech ball. Well, the get up roll, rather. Just we're seeing, e we're just seeing the same patient play from True Boy. Just standing on stage, waiting, waiting for J-Dizzle to commit to something for him to back air through and then just Going off stage, swinging the quarter. Yeah. That is this. This is the last stock of the set for him, unless he can take it out. Uh, true four. He, he did go into smash to kind of maybe just to spook him a bit, or trying to get that opening to just finish him off, as he has been getting. Yep. Uh, but let's see if JD is looking to get that bit of bit of merit. I want to say he had for now that smash. True to four go going for a really are. ballsy short hop landing up air. Jay Dizzle not falling for it and just putting himself in a much better position to take this game. The true four sitting in the center stage with his shield hard up. Yeah, he's doing his Jay Dizzle doing his best stance to really get rid of this shield and now it's down. Doing his doing his best to take the there lead. There we go. And that's the what's oh not the game. We almost went to the scoreboard there. <laughs> Ooh. Ah uh, classic forward tilt. Shield is back on mine for another couple seconds. <laughs> true fall. Uh, oh, the true fall ranks. betting it all on that backslash. <laughs> now, there's 44 seconds on the clock, and True Four has a what is that? 33% lead. 37. Oh, he's there. Go. He goes. Can we go to game five? Game five. Ooh. So the. So the Victorians and us, not very loud for their for their boy, but also the Australians are there kind of, yeah, just as a collective. This this is one of the few times where the whole crowd will kind of be on the same team. Pretty I mean, much. there will be true four clan, true four fans in the crowd, but the majority yeah. of them will want to kind of protect ourselves for Australia. We 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 don't want to make ourselves look so bad that any any international can just come in and win. Yeah. I don't know what. I don't know what Dylan's laughing at. He's just get laughing at me. Uh, yeah. All right. We're finally going to FD. Once again, <laughs> a stage I would have thought Jay Dizzle would be responsible for the big yeah. set. But maybe they just like each other. Maybe. And they're like, hey, you know what? You guys can have this. You can have yeah. the stage this time. True uh, four starting off really strong. With a quick four, fifty percent. Oh, oh. they're down here. Ooh. Smash, smash shot it with Toon Link at 50. It didn't look quite like what he was looking for. Uh, Jedi just needs to get some points on the board here to really catch up. Yep. Drew 4 holding oh. that shield. Not afraid of anything Toon Link could possibly throw at it. Such as the hook shot. Yeah. I don't see a lot of, a lot of, really a lot of Zairs coming out of uh, Jay Dizzle. He's kind of he opting more for that bomb sort of play instead of kind of pressure. usually use them? Uh, here and there, he's probably just throw one out there kind of to cover himself on his way down. But you'll see a lot of the time he'll, he'll use the bomb and the boomerang. Right, yeah. Because from, from what I understand, Toon Link's Zair isn't the most useful of his tools. Uh, it's not as good as other Zairs in yeah. the game, no. Like, it can occasionally be used for a, like, kill setup off by Zairing someone off the ledge into a fort air or something like that. Yeah. But other than that, you don't see it a lot. Nice use of the back air to just cover the true four's jump. Both players once again settling into their patient <laughs> yeah. styles. I do I do really enjoy the patient styles. Yeah. It's, it's it takes a lot of effort to really like actively yeah. not just throw yourself at your opponent. 
Um, and to see both players both having that sort of say, quote like lame sort of play style, yeah. um, I enjoy it personally. Yeah, I like I like seeing it. I like seeing the game's flow switch from the passive neutral into one player just going all out on their own. Yeah. Oh. True Four does have the lead here, so honestly, if he wanted to, he could just stand around yeah. for the next four minutes. And the way this game's going, if someone doesn't take a stop soon, I think we might go to Ooh. time here. <laughs> oh. Very nice. <laughs> oh, good tech there. These are some great recoveries from Jay Dizzle. Uh, F Smash isn't going to kill him. He's a heavy boy on shield. Jump's going to come down here. Is he going to get a good Josh off the bomb? Whoa. Yes, he is. And that's going to take the first stock here. Untactable stage flag from that bomb. Three and three minutes, three minutes and 22 seconds left of this game. Yep. And Jono has two stocks. True four, look at true four in Smash. He's on the hunt with that Smash. Looking for blood. True for now realizing that it's much more, yeah. much more important yeah. for him to go in. <laughs> oh, just, still coming out. Just getting repeatedly, just getting hit by everything for his troubles. Yeah, you know, last game he it was ahead, and he also had that game above him. This is game five, and he only has one stock left. Yeah. Maybe one of the, one of these is going into losers, yeah. uh, and might have to meet. Ah, well placed back there, there just. Landing just as the hitbox comes up. Jid is just taking a moment to consider what to do. He's gonna brace himself. That is puts a lot of emotion in the way he plays. Um, I call him the late viewer to smash. <laughs> <laughs> he also plays tennis as well, but he has the uh, he has his cap he usually wears as well, and he puts it backwards in place. And he likes to pop. He pops off because he puts a lot of energy and emotion into it. Yeah. Really strong, 79% lead. Good stage control for Jay Dizzle. Everything looking good for Jay Dizzle at the moment. Yeah, he's, he's just, he's just, as we saw in game two, he switched something on, and it's just kind of working for him. Ooh. Picks the wrong aerial, but Jay Dizzle just content to throw things around yeah. through for Just prevent him from ever getting anything done. Yeah. Even if it's, even if it's oh. not damaging him. Oh, <laughs> going for his up <laughs> throw up at 50 50 at 29%. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> getting really ambitious here. But True 4, unless he just keeps getting these nares going, he's going to need something like that to take this game. With only yeah, 90 that's... seconds left on the clock, against a character like Toon Link, you're going to have to work with it. Oh. A small, but that percentage lead is getting higher and higher to that scary Smash, yeah. Smash Monado uh, element where you could die at 60, 70 in Toon Link at that sort of rage in Smash. Even even at this point, with the amount of rage on Shulk, oh. he probably doesn't even need Smash to just land a nice up air slash uh, here. He's got to hold oh. on, but he's bombed himself. He needs another one to stay alive here. Ooh. Oh, and he just says, <laughs> back on stage, and there's 54 three seconds left, but I don't think this is going to go to Jay time. One of these control. people wants the other one dead. Ooh. Oh. 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 Everyone's, the on the edge of their, everyone's on the edge of their seat. John has to go really low. The bomb! It all boomerang! Ooh. Oh, he went the buster. the buster! Now we're in shield. True 4, probably a lot more comfortable now that his yeah. shield starts up. And the percent leads on True, not anymore. He's behind oh, by 9%. 20 seconds left. <laughs> game 5 of the first game of top 8. We haven't even started to get to the meat of this bracket, and we have this. Game five True already. Four in speed. Ten seconds he left. He needs to. He needs. <laughs> Eight seconds. Seven seconds. It's gonna go. Start start counting down. Five. John has realised he's only got three seconds left. <laughs> Just hold that. Shit. Oh, he gets him. He gets him on time and he's popped off. Going <laughs> stand of time in our first game. I did say at the start of this game five that we were gonna go to time. Uh, I did. I changed that decision on the last bit, but oh wow. Great call.